Alright, yo, what's good everyone? Nick Smith is back. Welcome to a new rebuild. Today we're going to be rebuilding the Memphis Grizzlies. They were in such a tough conference that, like, I don't know. They're up against the Clippers, obviously the Warriors, the Spurs, the Thunder. They, they can't win. Like, it's impossible for them to win. Um, so, this is a team that really needs to rebuild for the future. So, I guess it's, uh, it's time just to go after some first round picks. That's what I think we're going to do. So let's go after some first round picks to start out this series. Okay, here it is. This is actually better than... This is better. So the trade is, we get rid of our 2016 first round pick, two second round picks, Birdman, Jermichael Green, for the Washington Wizards 2016, 2017, 2018 first round pick, JJ Hickson and Drew Gooden. I will take that trade right there. We're going to be loaded with Washington picks. So yeah, hopefully the Washington Wizards don't do that well. Now, let's go after... I'm, I'm just trying to rack up these picks right here. I really just want to rack up on picks because I know they're going to come in handy. And look how much salary we... Like, look how much cat space we save. 10 million plus Matt Barnes. And we get Adrian Payne and a Minnesota first round pick. I will make that trade, definitely. Um, so now we've got we got a we still got a lot of picks left. We've got two 2016 picks. I want to see if I can get an Atlanta Hawks first round pick. Actually, Lance Stevenson. Do I get rid of Lance Stevenson? I might even do that. Yeah, I'll, I'll do because Lance Stevenson. Like, if we want Lance Stevenson, we can just get him back at the end of this season in free agency. Like, we don't need Lance Stevenson. We're not going to win a championship this season anyway. I know that. So there's no point trying to like trying to trade for plays that will help us win a championship when I think we need a trade for plays that will help us in the future, if you know what I mean. Like we, we want to get some first round picks. So I will take this trade. I will take this trade. We I will definitely take that trade. Like PJ Harrison, he's all right, but now we're loaded on picks. We've got a 2016 Timbulls, Sacramento, Washington, and Atlanta first round pick. And then what if we took your 2019 pick? Ryan Hollins for Joel Anthony. I'll, I'll take this. We get that 2016, 2017, and 2019 first round pick. We get rid of Jordan Adams, 2019, and a 2017 Wizards first round pick. I will take that. Alright, so now that's pretty much it for the, uh, for the trades of the picks. We have a lot of first round picks right now. Uh, we've got 2016... Timberwolves, Kings, Pistons, Wizards, Hawks. 2017 Pistons, 2019 first round Pistons, and a 2018 second round. And we've pretty much just kept most of the guys on the team. Now, I can see that we have a lot of centers. Holy crap, we got one, two, three, four, five. And we got Thiago Splitter on a two year massive contract. You gotta go, son. Now it's just time to clear up the cap space and then we can start the season. I'm gonna make this trade only because I think it's gonna be easier to get rid of Grievous Vasquez after, instead of having Tiago Splitter on a massive contract, because there was literally like no good trades for Tiago Splitter. And all I, all I really wanna do is just get rid of players that have a lot of, uh, a lot of uh, cat space. So if we get rid of them, then we can go into free agency and hopefully sign some good players. Um, so let's see if we can get somebody on a cheaper contract than Grievous Vasquez. This isn't bad right there. I'll probably take that trade. Um, the aim of this is just to not get rid of any first round picks. And I think that I will definitely take this trade right here. So we save like 6 million, 6 million in, in cash space with that. So now let's go back to the trade. Uh, we will keep obviously these three guys because they're they're the Memphis guys like they're the guys that probably won't get traded um, apart from Mike Conley because they he was actually predicted to uh, maybe go to a different team during this year's uh, trade deadline but he never ended up going anywhere Brandon Wright three years 17 million dollars he might be on the move and apart from that it might just be Drew Gooden and that's about it we get a first round pick out of this Okay, I'll take that. Thank you very much. I'll take a first round pick. Um, we'll just have to get rid of Aaron Baines now. But that shouldn't be too hard, right? And our team chemistry is going to be so bad. It's going to be crazy. Like, our team chemistry is going to be absolutely terrible. Um, just don't give up a first round pick. And this is the trade I need to make. 
unless there's anything else that's good that comes up. Tyson Chandler, but he's on a huge contract. Yeah, I will, I will take that trade right here. Markel Brown, welcome to... I could even... I could ask for a second round pick out of that as well. I came across this trade right here. It's just another second round pick that we can take in. So I will take that. Thank you for a second round pick. I don't expect to win many games. We have 7% team chemistry. That's the worst I've ever seen anyone have in terms of team chemistry. So expect our, um, expect our record to be really bad. Uh, but yeah, we're going to simulate to the halfway point of the season. And uh, yeah, let's see how many wins we can get. Alright, so at the halfway point of the season, our team chemistry has gone up a lot. I mean, it was at 7%, now we're at 79%, so a lot better. Um, if we go to the standings, conference standings, we're doing pretty bad. Alright, we're last. <laughs> we're last, but let me say this though. The Clippers and the Spurs, they're not doing that great either. Now, I honestly predict we can go from last into the playoffs. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, because you have to understand our team chemistry was so bad. It was so bad. 7%. We got so many losses at the start of this season that, like, it's not, like, we can actually come back. Like, we're, we have the worst record in the league, 17-36, but watch us make it to the NBA playoffs, okay? Watch us make it. Okay, maybe, maybe not. Maybe we didn't make it to the playoffs, but... That's, that's just all part of the plan. It's all part of the plan. This team needs a full rebuild, okay? Because we're not good enough to win a championship. Like, it's um, it's so hard. Like, I'm not saying this because I don't like the Memphis Grizzlies. I don't mind the Memphis Grizzlies. Like, I've got nothing against them. It's just literally, like, the conference that you're in, it's so hard for you to do well when you're matched up against the Spurs, the Thunder, the Clippers, the Warriors. With the roster that you... Like, I didn't even change the roster, really. Like, I kept Marcus o, Conley, Randolph. I mean, I kept some of these guys. Just those three, really. But, like, they're... Yeah. <laughs> but, like, they're just not good enough, all right? Straight up. I want him... Like, they're just not good enough to uh, to win a championship. Um, and, uh, yeah, we didn't make it. So, we might as well just simulate the current... Oh, actually, no. We'll just simulate the whole playoffs right here. I'm guessing the Thunder will win it. I don't reckon the Warriors. Okay. Okay, prove me wrong. I see Warriors. <laughs> should, should never doubt the Warriors, okay? My heat made it to the NBA Finals. That's pretty good, but... Now this is where it gets... This is where it gets exciting. Kobe retires, Duncan exciting. Duncan exciting? What? <laughs> KG retires, Kobe retires, Duncan retires, Paul Pierce retires, Dirk and Vince Carter retires. So that's a lot of really good players. All these guys go into the Hall of Fame. And now we're going into the, we're going into the draft lottery right here. We going into the draft lottery. We better be here somewhere. Okay, where are we projected to go? Second, fourth, eighth. Please be first. All right, so we're projected to go eighth right here. Probably will, and we do. So we got the eighth overall pick. We're projected to go here. Please not us. Please not us. Dang. We got fourth pick. Now, we, we gave the Wizards this pick, and we end up going second. <laughs> the Wizards and... Okay, this is weird, but the Wizards... We swapped picks with the Wizards, right? They went first, we got second. Bruh. But it's not that bad, because we also got their, like, their 20... We got, like, heaps of their picks. Like, I don't... You can't see it yet, but we got... They're 2016th, 2017th, and 2018th. And we will be good by 2017 and 2018, if you know what I mean. So it's actually not that bad. Can't, I don't really want to get rid of any one of these guys. There's no point. We might as well just head into the draft, see who goes number one. Um, I'm guessing Ben Simmons. Um, but we we really need a point. Uh, no, we need a small forward. I was about to say point guard, and I realized we got Conley. We need a small forward on this team, so... Who goes first? Ben Simmons. He's a small forward. We can't get Ben Simmons, but it's all good. We can uh, we can take Brandon Ingram. So actually, we'll have, we'll have a look at what what's been offered um, for this second overall pick. Uh, pick three. Why would I take that? Pick seven. Kemba Walker. Lamarcus Aldridge. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. I'll take. I will take. Chris Dunn's there. Chris Dunn's a beast, though. Chris Dunn, how tall is he? 
Six four. Can he play shooting guard? Actually, no. Buddy Heald's there. Buddy Heald is there. I really want Buddy Heald. We need a shooting guard and a small forward. I'm okay. I'll take Buddy Heald right here. And then with my fourth pick, I'll either take Jalen Brown or Brandon Ingram. All right, that's what's that's what's happening. So we get we get the boy Buddy Hill, which is awesome. I'll take Buddy Hill. He's a shooting guard. We need a shooting guard. So that is awesome. Welcome to the team, Buddy Hill. If you guys haven't seen Buddy Hill knock down these threes, he's a crazy three-point shooter. So welcome to the team, Buddy Hill. And now I really hope Brandon Ingram doesn't get. Oh, there's been a trade. The Hornets. Trade Kemba Walker to the 76ers. Please, Hornets, do not take... Well, they need a point guard, right? Oh. They took my guy. That sucks. All right, so since we need a small forward, let me take Jalen Brown. So, yeah, we got Jalen Brown. He's our new small forward. And uh, that should be good. And I'm pretty sure we're up quite soon, right? We're pick eight. So, yeah, we're here. Um, we got another first-round pick. And this is where I might look to trade it. I might look to trade our pick away and get something else. I actually wanted to go after a power forward in the draft, but Derek Favors is there. That's a great trade. We take we trade away our eighth overall pick and we get Derek Favors, which I think that will help us out because Zach Randolph is getting old. And we still have our 18th pick, so I'll see you guys once we have to go to our 18th overall pick. I might actually... I'll take Demetrius Jackson. I heard a bit about him. So, yeah, let's actually simulate to the end of the draft, and uh, I'll show you guys who I got. All right, so let's go to the rookie signings. We ended up getting Buddy Heald, Jalen Brown, and Demetrius Jackson. So I think this has been a very successful draft because not only did we get those rookies, we got Derek Favors, and, uh, yeah, that's awesome. Derek Favors, he can do some work for us. I mean, I think he might be a guy that we look to trade, but I'm not going to accept AC, not going to accept Bullock. I think we're good to go into um, into free agency. Mike Conley, let, let's go into free agency. And if we need to get somebody in free agency, like if we can't, then we'll go after Mike Conley. But if we can, then... Um, okay, well, let's offer Mike Conley a contract right here, just to be safe. Uh, let's offer him 10.5 uh, over four years. See what he says. That's the team. That's the roster. We literally have to go after a whole bunch of guys. Um, so let's do this. We don't really need to go after a after a big man. Like we got big men, but I would love to trade one of them. If you know what I mean. Like I would like to use them as trade value. What, what do you reckon LeBron says? Do you reckon LeBron wants it? Do I go after LeBron? No trade clause. I haven't got LeBron ever, ever. Ever in in a my in a my league series. So let's see what he says. No trade clause for LeBron. Uh, we'll offer Rondo a contract right here. Uh, why not? Why not offer Rondo a contract? We'll offer Conley a contract. Oh, we already did. Uh, we'll offer Hassan just because uh, we can use him as trade value. Uh, we'll offer Boban Marjanovic a contract. We'll offer Jeremy Lamb a contract because we just need to get a whole bunch of guys to help us out. Jeremy Lin, backup point guard. Uh, Lance Stevenson, for all the guys that were upset that I didn't keep him. There you go. Uh, J.R. Smith, a nice shooting guard. And let's see who starts with us and who doesn't. So Hassan accepted another offer. And all these guys are like, yo, 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 I haven't got LeBron James yet. Haven't ever got him in a my GM. I think I want to get LeBron. I think I do. So welcome to the team, King. I'm happy about that. <laughs> I'm happy about that. Like, come on now. We got the King on this team. I haven't ever got him in a my in a my league. So for all the guys that'll be that be like, yo, that's so unrealistic. I haven't got him. Okay, I never got him. So yeah, that's I got him. Okay, I got him. I actually got him. I want to get Conley though. I want to get Conley back. So can we can we sign him? He accepted another offer though, but it... Oh, wow, that sucks. Okay. I'm happy with free agency, yo. Yo, we got the king. 
the king. See, that's why That's why I went into full rebuild mode. I went into full rebuild mode because now we got the king to take on to take on the, uh, the west. I guess, and the east, but like, he was already on the east, you know? So, yeah, we're gonna go from full tank mode to full beast mode with the king right now. All right, so I just wanna see how well we do with the king on our team. So let's simulate to the halfway point of the season and uh, see how many wins we can rack up. So at the halfway point of the season, we're doing not, not that great, but like, it, it's okay. We're doing decent. We're 29 and 24, uh, which is obviously, I think it's fifth. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. It's sixth in the west, um, but it would be like fifth in the east. So I don't know, like, we're not doing that well, especially since we have LeBron. Like, you'd hope to do a little bit better, but I don't know. There's not really much I can do with this roster. I mean, maybe we can see what Derek Fabius is worth on the block. The thing is, like, I'm just really waiting on my young guys to develop, which might take a couple seasons, because we got Demetrius Jackson, Buddy Heald, and Jalen Brown. It might take a couple of seasons for these guys to get into the 80s, because once we're in the 80s, we're going to rise up and be a really, really good team with LeBron and all of our young guys. It just might take a couple of seasons. So I'm just going to simulate to the end of the season and uh, see where we end off. But once the young guys develop, then we'll be really good. Just at the moment, we're not doing too well. Wait, so now we're just not even in the... Bruh, we didn't even make it into the goddamn playoffs. Are you serious right now? Are you actually serious? We didn't even make it. We got Jalen Brown, Demetrius Jackson, both made it to the All-Rookie first team, and Buddy Hill made it to the All-NBA second team, and LeBron made it to the All-NBA first team, and we didn't make the playoffs. Oh, okay, we already skipped over it. We got two two guys. Uh, I'll, I'll accept both of these guys, I guess. Why not? We might as well. Um, okay, so now I guess we'll go after Trey Burke. Uh, see what Trey Burke says. And we can get Zach Randolph and Trey Burke signs with another team anyway, so... Yeah, don't think we, we even have enough, yeah, we don't have enough cash space to sign anyone anymore. Uh, let's just go to play progression. See if any one of our players actually went up. Uh, we got Brown, Buddy Heald, and Demetrius Jackson all going up, along with Lance Stevenson going up one. Which is actually good because, like, that just means our rookies are just developing. And by the time we're in, like, hopefully by the time we're in, like, Next season, hopefully we can do some work in the playoffs. We just have to wait for our rookies to develop, which will take some time. All right, so we're looking a little bit better. LeBron, still there. Favors is still here. Gasol, Randolph, Brown, Hills, Stevenson, Demetrius Jackson. All these guys are going up a little bit. We still, we still got these two rookies that we just signed. And we got CJ Watson, Martel Webster, and Jeff Adrian. But I want to see if maybe if... If he's worth anything. I want to see if Derek Favors is worth anything for one last time. I really hope he is, but something tells me that he's not. Actually, our pick might be pretty good. Isaiah Thomas? That's not that bad, but we don't really... Actually, we do need... We do need a point guard. We do actually need a point guard. Because we don't have a good point guard. Yeah. And we still have Zach Randolph to play on at power forward. I will take that trade. Thank you very much. Isaiah Thomas, welcome to the Memphis Grizzlies. So, it's a little bit of a different story this season. We're a lot better. We are second in the conference, second in the West. Uh, conference right here. OKC's up top, Golden State's fourth, Minnesota's third. And I mean, second, I'll take that. Um, and I think we're good. We can simulate to the end of the season. Like, no need to make any trades. We're doing pretty well. And uh, hopefully we do some work in the uh, in the playoffs. MVP goes to Durant. This guy wins Rookie of the Year. I got no idea who that is. Joking wins Six Man. Davis wins Defensive Player of the Year. And Jalen Brown wins Most Improved. Uh, he's beasting, feasting. 16 points and eight rebounds for Jalen Brown. So this is why. This is why you you got to just develop the rookies. Develop the rookies. Steph Curry is a goddamn 80, 98 overall. So that's crazy. Uh, ben Simmons already makes it to the All-NBA second team. That's crazy. 
Uh, wait, did we get LeBron? Where's LeBron? LeBron's not even there. Oh, there he is. All NBA 13 goes to LeBron right there. Um, and LeBron, all NBA second team. And that is pretty much it. So, where are we? We're third. Finished third. Um, so, that's awesome. Let's, uh, let's, uh, let's simulate up against the New Orleans Pelicans. So, simulate game one. We win game one. Win game two. Lose game three. Win game four. And win game five. So we're advancing. And you have to be kidding me. Yeah. Why couldn't the goddamn Clippers beat the Warriors? Now we're screwed, okay? Now we are seriously screwed. Alright, let's... Let's... Si you know what? You know what? Let's simulate game one. Let's simulate with Simcast. Please beat the Warriors. I'm just hoping that maybe I can hop into the game if it's close. Just to get us a win. But right now, it looks like we're going to actually win this game. But it's really close. Oh, no. Okay, we have... Oh my good. Oh, okay. Hopping in. Hopping in. This is where this is where it counts. Alright, let's do it. And we have the ball, which is awesome. Uh, but I'm giving it to LeBron. So everybody just gotta move the hell out the way. Let the train come through. Actually, you know what? Let's get a screen by Selinger. Alright, good screen. LeBron's there. Okay, they're double teaming. Oh no, they're not. LeBron, up and under, up and under. There it is. Too easy. That's the king right there. It's too easy. Ties up this game. All we have to do is play good defense. But, uh, oh crap. How did he just get... See, that's Hall of Fame. He just, like, zooms, zooms past you. But, um, yeah. Let's do pick and roll with Isaiah. LeBron and Isaiah. What a connection. Give it to LeBron. Right here. Crossover. No, let's get in the post. Oh, I could have taken that shot, but I'm 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 heading, I'm back in the post. Up and under, and one, and one, and one. That's the kick. Flex on him, LeBron. Flex on him. Too easy. That's the king right there, man. That see, that's just too easy. That's the king. I'm I'm first. I'm I'm gonna show you what's on Hall of Fame. Cause uh, you know some people always like tell me you know, that's on Hall of Fame, bro. It's always on Hall of Fame. If I freaking miss this, okay. One point game. Do not let Clay Thompson. Or Steph Curry shoot the ball. Easier said than done. Oh, I, I almost, I felt a reach right there. I felt a steal. Oh, why did he get caught up on the screen? <gasps> Isaiah, what are you doing, bro? Okay, LeBron, it's your time to shine. It's your time to shine. LeBron from downtown. Oh my God, it's the king, it's the king, it is the king. Woo! Oh my... Look, 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 look at that, look at that Hall of Fame right there. LeBron James is the freaking king. There we go, we take game one. Guarantee we're gonna lose the series, but... Oh man, that was a crazy game, but I will take that game one. There we go, I'll see you guys in game two. Alright, here we are, game two. Let's simulate with Simcast right here. Please win this game. Like, we won that first game away, which hopefully should help us out. And we're going to win game two as well. We are up freaking 2-0. Let's go. Do they have any injuries? Because they might have an injury. I really hope they do. Okay, they don't. That kind of sucks. But we're up 2-0. Please. Please. We're at home now. We are at home. Do not lose this game. Woo! We might actually sweep. The freaking Warriors. Like, how crazy is that? 3 0. I'm gonna simulate game right here, and we, we sweep him. We sweep him, and please, Dallas. Dallas win. Dallas loses. Alright, here it is. Now we're up against the freaking Thunder. The Thunder with the reigning four time NBA MVP and Russell Westbrook, who's injured for one to two weeks. Please don't play through the injury. I, think, I don't think he can play through the injury. That might help us out a ton. Please, simulate game one. Simulate, okay, 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 okay. Let's go! Let's freaking go up against the Detroit Pit. Who do the Pistons have? Come on now, if the Pistons beat us in the NBA Finals, I'm about to be pissed. They got Drummond, they got Drummond. They got Drummond, and that's about it. So let's simulate game one. We win game one. 
But he heals out for the season. Come Bruh. on, man. Bruh. Buddy healed is freaking out for the. Well, we have depth. We have depth, 2K. If you screw us over, we have some depth. We win game two. Lose game three. Okay, here it is. Simulate Simcast to win the NBA. I think we've done it, people. We've done it. We've done it. We win the NBA championship. So I'm about to hop into the game. Jump in. Four seconds left. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please smash that like button. Leave a like on the video just to show your support. If we can reach, I, I've got faith in you guys. If we can reach 1,000 likes, I will upload the next rebuild, which I think is the Atlanta Hawks. So that should be exciting as well. Uh, obviously, in the next one, we won't go after LeBron. This is just a one-time thing. There'll be certain teams. I'll make it just for you guys because I know a lot of you guys are probably going to be upset that I got LeBron. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a rebuild. It's how quick I can win the championship in 2K with certain teams. That's what it is. Um, but I'll make sure I'll limit myself to only five teams that can get LeBron. How about that? That, 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 that? I reckon that's fair. There's 30 teams in the league. Only five of those rebuild teams um, can get LeBron. And I think that's fair. So this is so I only can yeah get four teams. Um, what the hell? I can only get four teams, uh, four more teams that I can play with uh, to get LeBron. So that's that. But I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new. And we won the championship. Let's go!